What's going on? We're back with another video in this uh, mini bug out series, bug out bag video. Um, and this is kind of the pouch that has all this this kind of stuff in it, and this top one here. This is where my fire starting stuff goes, and this is kind of the miscellaneous uh, pocket, I guess. Uh, anyway, so with fire starting, you can never ever have enough ways of starting. You know, having means of being able to start a fire. Uh, so having more than just one option is definitely a good idea. Um, of course, everybody should have a lighter. You, know, you can pick these up pretty cheap, gas stations. Make sure it has plenty of fluid in it. You can never have more than... You can always have more than one way of fire, so... There's some matches. There's two ideas right there. These little wet fire things. These are kind of like a fire starting. They've got like little tinder and stuff in them. It's kind of like a deal you can start a fire with. And then you can have chapstick. Which if you read it under here. Uh, and the active ingredient. It's actually petroleum, it's petroleum based. So just get the original unscented. You don't need any scented or whatever but definitely put a couple of these in your bag because you can use these of course you know it's got more than one use you can use these for tap lifts or you can use them to start fire and it doesn't take very much either another idea is you can get some cotton balls and petroleum jelly and you can kind of just open your petroleum jelly and put them you know just get some petroleum jelly on these cotton balls and uh, that way you have a way of of starting Fire that way too with just like a uh, with a lighter or you can use magnesium uh, fire starter or a flint which is the other thing I have kind of in here in my little survival kit for the fire and get it out of there there you go this one's been used a little bit but that's okay uh, these things are handy, handy, handy. Definitely cannot stress enough have one of these at a bare minimum. Um, and then, of course, if you want some tinder, just get you some uh, cotton balls and put them in like a little container like this. And again, I, you know, I have some more duct tape on that one. Um, and then also have some other tinder and stuff, you know, in in a little kit like that. And another one is steel wool. If you take a magnesium stick just like this, or a flint, which is one thing I don't have in here, but I probably need to get one. Um, you strike the flint, and it'll light this. So there's one way. Here's two, three, four, five, six seven ways on how to light fire right there and it's not very heavy and they're definitely good ideas so you might give it a thought and think about maybe trying something like that okay so anyway here's some of the miscellaneous stuff I'm just going to kind of briefly go over I'm not going to go into great detail with them um, but definitely it's a good idea to have some uh, 550 paracord I was a hundred foot. I probably need to have more in there, but you know this is. But I'll I'll eventually get some more. Uh, water purification tablets, definitely a need. Fishing line, you know, get something that has a little bit of you know breaking strength to it. You know, eight pound test is is not bad. That's definitely a good way to go. You don't want anything too light. You don't want anything too heavy. Um, you know, a couple pens and a pencil in case you need to write stuff down. Got some more Q-tips in here, like a little mini pry bar. These things are really handy. Definitely could use one of those in your bag. Uh, just a little knife, you know, something that you could, you know, clean animals and stuff with. Be a good idea to have one of those. Definitely keep it sharp, and you need a knife sharpener too. Probably put it in here. I don't have one in here yet, but I will probably get one. Uh, camp mirror, which is definitely good to have because you know you want to see yourself. You know, when you're in the bug out, I guess. Um, 
maybe an orange vest if you want to keep in touch you know with your with your teammates maybe just maybe just an idea to have but if you want to keep away from everybody else you know you probably don't want that seeing that it will make you stand out in an environment but you could also use this in a, in a strategic sense you could use this kind of as a decoy to get somebody because orange is a really bright color and this hunter orange vest you can you know kind of draw off some attention you know if you get in a situation where you need uh kind of some breathing room definitely you, know, you set that up somewhere and you know kiss the eye of somebody and you can kind of get get out of dodge uh get a hot compress couldn't fit it in that that, that medical pouch so uh definitely a good idea to have one of those a little mini shovel These things are really handy. They're pretty light too. You can get these in the camping section at Wally World. It comes with a little case. You can put it on a bell if you want. Uh, fishing stringer. Definitely got to have one of those. Then like a little mini fishing kit. You know, I'll put some, some jigs, some lures, maybe a bobber or something like that. Some split shots, a couple hooks. And of course you already have your line. So there you go. Now you just need to stick to tie that line to. Or, you know, if you have a small fishing pole. Something like this, you can probably fit in your bag. You know, it's one of these little three footers you can get at Walmart for like 14 bucks or something like that. Um, you know, you can just get you a cheap pair of gloves, something that's gonna, you know, work for you. These are like two bucks, you know, not too bad. And then, of course, a, a way of, uh, you know, staying warm or whatever, kind of use these maybe as a little bit of a torch or something. Uh, definitely use. A couple uh, candles. Get the unscented kind. That way, you know, you're not. So that way, they don't have any scent and stuff to them. So just get a couple unscented candles. But there's kind of an idea of just some miscellaneous stuff that you can you throw in your bag, make things a little bit easier. Um, definitely, the water purification tablets is definitely neat. But uh, that's kind of my video on the fire starting and kind of some miscellaneous stuff that uh, you could use in there, tool wise. And we'll get back to you with another video on uh, in this little mini uh, bug out bag series. Have a good day.